Hi and welcome to a new Vengeance Producer Suite Avenger video about the new granular update features. I would like to show you um, how to record your own envelope movements. This is possible with the new update. And let's start by choosing a vocal loop, for example. This one, maybe. Turn on loop so it's synced. And at the moment you can see the envelope moves linear from the very start of the sample to the end here in a linear connection. And what you can do now is record anything you do with the position dial. And um, let me add some drums so I have a better feeling for the, um, for the tempo. And now you can press the record button here and now it's pending, it's waiting for the first key. If you hit a key now, the record is starting and it will record anything which is happening with the position dial. So let's try it. Okay, not bad. Once again. Or something like this. This is quite cool. See, I'm bis uh, a bit of lacking behind the time. So, of course, you can make adjustments here. This one should be here. And, of course, we could also add a mini chain here. And I can create an offset here by changing the starting point. Now this would change the entire loop. Here. Uh, what's also funny is that you can also use an external MIDI controller here to record your position movement. What I've done now is I've linked the mod wheel here with my position dial and I also could record this movement here in the same way. Okay, I have to turn on the envelope. So, once again. Okay. And uh, for example, you also could use an LFO by, for recording. And here, maybe, yeah, with a sign shape. So now, this has been also recorded. You can now remove the LFO from the, the mod matrix, since you have recorded it in your envelope. Okay, I think that's enough for, for now. See you in the next video. Bye.